I fell down a TikTok hole. I mean, things. Hello and welcome back to another video. So I did fall down a TikTok, sh TikTok, no, TikTok shop hole. I fell down a TikTok shop hole. So I thought it would be cool for us to try everything together. I was scrolling. I kept seeing all these things on my For You page and I just wanted to try them and see what they're about. And I love watching videos of people trying food. So I thought I'd just make one. But I've got some freeze-dried freeze dried candy from a shop on TikTok shop. I got some of these Oreo wafer rolls, which I love the wafer rolls anyway. So if they're Oreo, they're gonna be a winner. I keep seeing people trying these. Now, I remember these as a kid growing up. They were my favorite chocolates. They smell so good. <laughs> Try those. I hope they taste the same as I remember. I don't know whether they will. I then also, really late to the trend, I wanted to try the pickle thing. So I love pickles. So I fell down the hole of buying the pickles. I did just go for a dill pickle because I kind of thought first time try the easiest and then I've got the little roll-ups which are sizzling red and yellow oh, so they're both red and yellow so I have no idea what that is whether that's like sweet or but those are the little roll-ups it then also came with the like tagine sauce and also the sour thing don't know what that is and then these the taxis which again I wouldn't eat blue crisp, but they say they're hot chili pepper. Hot chili pepper and they're blue. That freaks me out a little bit, not gonna lie. But there is that. Might have to try that not on the bed because nobody wants pickle juice anywhere. And then I came across this company that do American candy. So I got an entire box of just American sweets or, yeah, probably things that the UK don't do anymore. So they're probably not all American, but like, what is this? A mint, a mint patty. Oh, you probably won't be able to see it because of the, you know. But like, what's that? A slow poke? Let me get closer. So we've got a slow poke, can you see that? Whatever that is. Hershey's, I know I love a Hershey's. So that's gonna be a winner. Do you remember these? You've got like mini pizzas and a mini burger. I think that's fizzy. It's a little fizzy mini burger. And then millions, which we do still have in the UK. Laffy Taffy. I feel like I remember this from Wreck-It Ralph. Again, I've never tried it. Never tried Laffy Taffy. Laffy Taffy. Oh, that's bubble gum. No idea. And then I feel like I remember these sour, like the warheads. I feel like I remember those. And then these look like. Okay, so these are called Smarties, not what I know as Smarties. Smarties in the UK are little, little chocolate coated things. There is so much in here, it's ridiculous. I will show you. There's so many flavours of Laffy Taffy. Ridiculous. What are these? Lemon candy. I mean, I think I'll save that for somebody else. Double bubble bubble gum. Oh my gosh, this is a burger, but it says it's gum and it says it's filled ketchup like liquid. Oh, stop it. I kind of want to just try that right now. Should I just do it? Oh my God, it smells really sour. Oh, tastes like hubba bubba. It's like UK bubble gum. Too many. 
I mean, it's nice. I've never really liked the concept of bubble gum. I kind of freaked me out. I also forgot in the TikTok shop hole chin things. So many things. So we'll go through everything. I think I'm going to do the food first because I feel like I'm going to enjoy that way more. Welcome to my French bulldog. Let's try some, try some sweets. We might start with the freeze dried candy, which is all over TikTok shop. I'll link where I bought it from. Oh, so what have we got in here? Luna, stop it. I don't know what any of these are. I mean, whatever that was, delicious. And Skittles, it's got Skittles. I prefer them, <laughs> the normal Skittles. You can't have any. Okay. More sour, actually. I want to try this. If anyone knows what this is, please let me know. I can't tell what it is. You can sit here with me. Okay, I think this one might be a marshmallow. No, that's a marshmallow, right? That one. So what's this? Oh, the flavors are so intense. Wow. I already eat the whole thing. No idea what they are. They are stuck in my teeth. These, these are high hopes. These are giving me high hopes. Oh, I thought you got a whole bowl. I shouldn't get three little packets. That last pink one, so sour. Okay, so they come in little, little individual packets that I can't get into, that Luna would very happily get into. No. Is this what they look? What do they smell like? They smell like Nesquik chocolate cereal. They're good. They don't taste like Oreo. They don't taste like Oreo at all. They just taste like Nesquik chocolate balls. I give them like four out of ten. Not really great. Just not what I was expecting. I feel like I was a bit disappointed. They just don't taste like Oreos. They taste like Nesquik chocolate balls. Yeah. Am I, am I doing it the wrong way around, leaving the pickle till last? Right, Milky Bar Chew. First thing I notice, how small, in comparison to my hand. I don't have overly big hands. Oh, that smell. I know you really love it. You can't have it. You're very cute. Oh, the smell. The texture is like I remember. Mm. The aftertaste is so much better. They are so good. Mm. I'm gonna have to put them away because I would eat the entire packet. They are really good too. I'd probably give them like an 8.5 out of 10. And the freeze dried candy, 10 out of 10. Oh my gosh. The flavors when it's freeze dried, so intense. Milky bar, eight out of 10. Oreo, four out of 10. I'm just a bit scared of that pickle. If I'm honest. I'm gonna pick three things out of this box. Definitely the Laffy Taffy. That is one thing I've heard about but never really tried. <laughs> it's a little tiny watermelon. It's a teeny tiny watermelon. That's really cool. Okay, so I'm gonna try Laffy Taffy. Never heard of this. Love how American candy has stuff that's got artificially flavoured. Nothing in the UK. Ours are always like, no artificial colours or flavourings. Laffy Taffy, Zot's Apple, and Sea Roll. Those are the three that we're going to be tasting. I will post them on my Instagram. Okay, we're going to go for the Tootsie Roll first. What is a Tootsie Roll? Is it just like toffee? You hear her snoring. I don't really know what that's like. Toffee, <laughs> chocolate toffee. Yeah, I haven't finished it because I'm not the biggest fan. Hmm, I can't even think what it resembles to like UK candy at all. Laffy Taffy. This is gonna be stick. I can't even get it out of the packet. 
Okay, I will eat paper on sweets, but not plastic. Oh gosh, this is tragic. Okay, okay, we're good, what it looks like. It smells like a wham bar. If you know, you know. It says jokes on every wrapper. Why do bananas enjoy gymnastics? They like to make the splits. That doesn't taste like what I wanted it to. Almost like soap. No. It's a no from me. Hey, this is a Zotz apple sweet. This has got sherbet in the middle. That is a choking hazard. Sour. Anybody else a biter? I don't know how to describe that. It's got like sherbet, but it like fizzed when it hit my tongue. It's not the one. Oh, that was like having a mouthful of, you know, when you pour like a, a lemonade or a Coke, that was like having just the foam in your mouth. Okay, I like the hard candy bit, but not the middle bit. Okay, so so far, American candy is not as good as British sweet. The mini I remember these as a kid and this is so nostalgic. Oh my god, it's so cute Look at it. Look at the little slices Cheers This is where it's at. These are great mm -mm -mm. So good. So so far The American candy has not been the one So now I'm gonna try the pickle We've got a plate and I've got said pickle. I don't really know what I'm doing, but I feel like I've watched lots of videos of people doing it, so I'm just gonna go for it. Oh, why? Try everything individually. I mean, I don't even know what that is. I mean, I should use their teeth for everything. I literally I don't even know what this is. Oh, that's that smells hot. Like spicy. I'm gonna regret doing this. One of the things that I see people do it and then I'm like, that's a really good idea. This looks cool. That tastes amazing. That's like a fruit winder. Which UK friends, you know what that is. They're, although they're not as good as they used to be. Like we used to have big chunky ones, can't get the chunky ones anymore. And then the double ones were like two different flavours. So I've used, I've seen people use both. So I've got both ready. This is my plate. Hot stuff, disgusting sour stuff, fruit rolled ups. These things. Let's we'll try one of these. Look at them. I just don't understand why they're blue. Weirdly quite nice. I'm actually not offended by those. Offended by the colour. Oh, this is good, isn't it? Free, low calorie, low carb, and gluten free. It doesn't smell very real, if I'm honest. It's not giving me, I grew it in my greenhouse. People try the sauce. Do I try the sauce? Okay, no. Right. Oh, this is big as my head. Okay, got the pickle out. I don't want my entire bear smelling like pickle juice. I'm not gonna, people make a hole in it. I'm wrapping these things around like this. I feel like, okay, people cut a hole in the top. I've done it with my scissors, so they'll need cleaning. Like people then stick these just gonna stick one in okay oh my god it's so slimy okay and then they put some of this on the top oh my god I'm scared and then this stuff which don't know what it is okay are you ready oh. 
Hold on, does that work? That shouldn't work. I mean, this stuff is all stuck around my teeth. Mm. Mm. I think I like it. I don't enjoy how watery the, the pickle is. It's so stuck in my teeth. kind of feel like I need one of these in there. The taxis ruin it. But the pickle with that sprinkly stuff and the sour stuff, great. But not with the blue crisp, not the one. Okay, I've washed my hands. I feel like that was way less traumatizing than I was expecting. It's probably not something I'm gonna eat anytime soon. Okay, now into the easiest part of the TikTok haul. Haul, I don't know. Some things, a little gadget, which I found. The first thing I found was this. It says it's a cooking machine. It's not a cooking machine. It does also look like it's from Tiger. It's got that very like tiger, flying tiger aesthetic. So it's actually a little chopper. So you've got a little charger. I'll take it out of its packaging. So this is it. I went for the green, because I love green, and it chops. This is gonna make my life so much easier. I hate chopping garlic. It's just like the worst thing to chop, but this. It's gonna make it so much easier. And actually, I've just realized that it's really easy to take apart and wash, which is super handy. Come charge. I haven't plugged that in. That's good to go. I love that. I don't know how much it was. I used to have one of these and I bought it from Flying Tiger and it didn't last very long. So I can't imagine this is gonna last very long, but it's a little like mixer, maker. Obviously it's not a cappuccino maker, but it, it froths your milk. I bought one of these. It does require batteries. I have not put batteries in it. But I went for the pink. It's all right, it seems quite substantial. Let's see how long it lasts, but it was super cheap. But I like, I like a little frothy milk on with my frappuccinos that I make. So it'd be quite cool to have a little froth. These, I saw these and knew I had to have them. So we use food clips all the time. Can't get in it, I can't use my scissors. I put the scissors in the pickle. Right, so these, I saw these, I thought, I just need them. They're so adorable. We do actually use them a lot. So, they look like a portion of fries or chips. They look like fries. And they're little crinkly clips that you then put on packets of food, which look great. And it's got a magnet on the back. So I can magnet it. I won't put it on the fridge, but I will put it on the magnetic board that's in our kitchen. Super handy. Straight in. Yes, I've got a bag of crisps. Oh, I have got a bag. I need a clip. Put the clip on, put it together. Stays fresh. I couldn't resist. I'm stuck all over my bird. Because that's gross. All things. This one, this is how it came packaged. I haven't even opened it. This one, apparently, you can reseal packets. I don't know if it works or how it works. And it doesn't come with any instructions. Does it need batteries? Oh, okay. It requires batteries. That's really helpful. All the instructions are in, this might, I don't want to be like super ignorant, but it might be in Japanese. I think you put some batteries in it. So, oh, that's a safety guard. A little flip down thing. On this and not my face. I don't know if you can see that very well, but that's very cool. So this apparently you can reseal, I assume like crisp packets and stuff. Last gadget of them all. Does anybody know what? No. No idea. Well, this is something. If this works, so handy. It's a jar opener. I struggle a lot with opening jars. Just can't get the stretch out of the strength and the grip. This cups over the top. Gives you leverage. Action of colours. But yeah, I'm gonna test that out, see if it works. And that's that's all the things that I bought from my TikTok shop drop hole thing. That's me trying it. I'm don't think I'm gonna eat any more of that pickle. I'm definitely going to eat more of these freeze-dried candies. These are delicious. That's me over and out. I'm gonna clear up my entire mess. 
I tried a pickle, which oddly I would do again, but not today. If you had liked this video, please like and subscribe. Don't forget to follow the Instagrams. I'll pop them on the screen down here. I'm going to go and enjoy some more freezer dried candy. Please comment below. I want to know what videos you want to see. Or anything else you want to know. But in the meantime, I'm going to enjoy my candy. See you soon. Bye.